Hello everyone, this is John from Finate and today I have got for you another recap of our recently closed trades and our stock trading. So the first ticker I would like to share with you is Alibaba Group. This is a weekly chart and uh, it may not be visible at the first sight, but the market is still some kind of uptrend. We can draw this trend line here and uh, we can see the price reacted for many times on the trend line. So, let's take a look at what happened in previously previous month. The price broke this last swing high. We've got the break right here. Then the price retraced back down. It got through this our support zone. But the reaction we've got on this trend line from buyers was very strong. The buyers went to the market, went through the zone again, and here is the time that we've got interested in this market. We were waiting for the price to retrace back to the zone and confirm that the zone is still valid and we can trade from there to the upside. So let me switch to daily. Yes, right here on this bar, our technical analysis got confirmed that the zone is still valid, that the sellers aren't strong enough to go through the zone, and we took a long trade. As you can see, uh, the stop loss is right below below this low. We've got we like to uh, give it some space, not put the stop loss right below the last last uh, swing low. Uh, and we trade with the risk reward ratio 1 to 2, so twice the profit target to the stop loss. The price got, uh, got test tested the zone one more time right here, and uh, then we've got our profit target a few days later, and it got closed on uh, 19th of May, so just two days ago. So, uh, another ticker I wanted to show you was uh, this one, Billy Billy. This is quite a young company. We can see it's uh, traded uh, since April of uh, 2019. And uh, since it started trading, we can see that the chart created something like triangle, something like this. The buyers tried to push the price higher and sellers weren't able to make lower low, as you can see here. Here eventually we've got break from the from the triangle, and uh, we waited for the price to retrace back to this area to this zone. Let me zoom it. Yeah, right here from the profile to this area to this zone, and we've waited again for a confirmation that the zone is still valid, and that the buyers are in the market from the zone, and we can trade. Now we switch to daily and we can see the reaction on the zone was pretty strong here we've got to the zone and the buyers just came into the market and two large green bars appeared on the chart we've entered the trade right here it may seem a little bit a little bit far from the zone but uh, we trade according to some rules that we tested long long time and uh, yeah, the entry point might be uh, a little bit better, but it was uh, it was uh, okay by the rules. So we entered the entered the market here. We we put our stop loss right below this uh, this zone. We've got quite lucky here because the market came pretty close to the stop loss. So here here it would be great opportunity to enter the market with a much better price but uh, uh, it was uh, it was okay we the market didn't kick us and uh, a few weeks later we've reached our profit target right here yeah again it was may 19th so two days ago we've closed uh, our profit target right here again the the risk reward is one to two so twice the profit target to stop loss one last trade i wanted to share with you is uh, tetra tech let me let me check the chart we can again see from the weekly chart that the market is in in an uptrend so 
we have pretty similar situation as on the first uh, chart we've seen today. The market got through the support, reacted on the trend line, then got back up. Again, we were waiting for a confirmation for the retracement back to the zone, confirmation that the zone is still valid, so we can trade to the long side. Again, let's switch to daily and let's see what happened. Right on this bar, the confirmation uh, was there. We've, we've confirmed that the zone is valid. We've got some rejection here, so we entered the market. Uh, the market, the market tested the zone for for a few more days, and then it went uh, up. It broke from this small for, from this small trading range. And it appeared that the price might go higher and eventually, hopefully, to the to the profit target. Uh, the next day, the price collapsed, got through the zone, and a few days later, we've got stopped on a stop loss on 12th of May. The market reacted again on the trend line very nicely, like to the, to the tick. So the trend line is very strong here. The market is still in some kind of uptrend, but at this moment, there is no opportunity for us to trade uh, long. We can see here, let me draw this. Uh, we can see we've, we've inside some kind of trading range here. And uh, we have to wait for the, for the market to give us another opportunity. Maybe leave the trading range, wait for another retracement. We'll see. But at this point, there is no new entry for us. Okay guys, uh, that's it. That's some of our recently closed trades. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you next time. Take care.